Hello everyone, it's Cassandra Lyons with Dancing to Raise Your Vibration. And I just wanted to pop on here today to share a little bit about some exciting things that I have coming up. So um, I have recently uh, changed my business name, which is now The Luminary Soul, S-O-L. Used to be Be Beautiful You, some things have shifted and changed in my life and it's really about just stepping into your light, shining your light, being the fullness and truth of who you are. And so dancing is such an incredible way, as you know for me, to really connect deeply to the truth of who you are. And I call that, you know, God, source energy, all that is, soul, S-O-L, which is all about the light and the truth of who you are. And so I am going to be sharing a lot more about this in the coming days, but for now, I just wanted to just pop on here, dance with you a little bit. I wanted to also share that I have, whoops, I guess we're gonna be dancing now. Actually, I'll dance now. doing videos and things just happening as they do. And so what I, <laughs> and plus I haven't really danced consistently for a while. And so that's part of why I'm gonna be sharing some things with you. Dance is such an incredible way to feel good, to just, Connect, like I said, connect within, allow your energy to raise, just shine your beautiful light, and you obviously f can feel good. And it isn't about really, um, it isn't about like choreography, although choreography is super fun, but it's about um, allowing the music to truly move your body. So it's if you hear a song and your body just wants to move, I say go for it because in doing so, not only are you gonna feel just that feeling and that excitement and fun when you find yourself just feeling really good, um, but also when you're in that heightened state, when you're in that higher vibration, you are tuned in to all the things that you're truly desiring. You're tuning into your inner guidance, your inner being, and then you're receiving the impulses, the ideas, the inspiration that's always coming to you. It is literally always coming to you. It is not something that um, 
kind of is there, kind of isn't there. The only reason that you don't hear it is because you're in a lower vibration and you're not in that same frequency as what it is that you want to be receiving. So, and I'm talking like insights and impulses and new ways of doing something. So if you have an issue that you're having a problem with, this, when your energy goes up, you're going to be in that vibration of the solution or multiple solutions because for every issue that you bring into the future, you're also bringing with you multiple solutions as well. So the other aspect of it that, the other aspect of dancing and what I've noticed over the 42 years of dancing is that I used to say, that when I would go out on the dance floor, let's say when I was younger and in college and I would just go and dance completely sober, but my, I would go out and literally, I would say problems were getting solved on the dance floor. Like I was getting in, insights and information of how to do something, like I said, that I hadn't, couldn't figure out how to do um, because it was figuring out. It was like trying to go upstream to look for whatever problem or solution is downstream. So when the other part of when I'm dancing is that it's also naturally releasing resistance. So if I have resistance to a particular thing, so it could be, you know, money coming in, it could be a relationship being the fullness of what it is. It could be, um, you know, whatever creating a program or you just you feel like it's like when you're doing something you feel kind of that that pull like you're not like you're just it's not that flow where things are just like in the flow feeling good things are working you're feeling excited and alive and vibrant and so you might feel the the like I said the resistance but when you dance it's like there is this thing that happens when you get into that place where you just let the music move your body and you just allow your body to kind of unwind itself. I've done massage and body work in craniosacral for 21 years and there's a process that's called uh, craniosacral and it's and one of the things that I do with that is is just in holding let's say someone's head and they had a lot of neck troubles going on one of the things I would do is just allow their head to move with my support, just kind of move and unwind. It's almost like imagining if you have this wound up rubber band and you're just holding it at the top and it just unwinds itself. That's what's happening is that your body is kind of realigning to its natural state. And it's the same thing with dance is that when you dance and you just let the music move you, you're realigning with your natural state, your natural well being. The, the light of your soul, the truth of who you are. And then that's when life, in those moments, that's when life flows, that's when life is working. That's when there's ease and there's joy and there's fun and there's freedom and there's this energy that's just flowing. And that's one of the things that I am going to be sharing in my upcoming course, uh, Illumine Your Soul. And it is a 14 day dance and journal course. And we are really going to be using dance, first of all, like I said, to connect within to your inner being, the truth of who you are, those insights, inspiration, you know, really getting into the connecting in your heart to that space of love and, um, and knowing what it is that you want and allowing your energy to raise and using the journal prompts to continue to try to uh, not understand, just to continue to um, connect with your inner guidance in a way that is different than just thinking about it, but you're writing it, you're seeing it, you're visually seeing what you're writing, you're, you're noticing where there's ease, and then you're noticing maybe where there's some out of alignment feelings. And it's all okay. Everything is okay, like always. Like, you know, you just have, sometimes you have what I call the compost moments, so they're not bad, they don't feel good, they stink. But at the other end of the spectrum is what you want. And the compost, it's like you're taking the compost moments and you're sprinkling that over here 
in the direction of what you desire and it helps that to grow. And so anyway, I am going to be uh, posting some more information about this course, but the course does, it is launching on Monday. It might start a few days late. I have a few people that are saying um, that it might be better for them a few days later. So I will keep you posted. But for right now, if you want to find out more, go to my website, Cassandra dash lions l y o n s dot com and look for the illumine your soul dance and journal pro course and if you have any questions you also can feel free to email me at b be beautiful you coaching which is b e the word beautiful y o u coaching at gmail dot com so i am super excited if you know anybody who is interested in just using dance, using journal, and oh, and I journal prompts, and I am going to be doing a guided visualization as a way of continuing to help you dive into that space within you that knows everything, that is truly just the light and the truth of who you are, and so that you can really be living the life that lights you up. So if you, if you know anybody, please feel free to pass this video along. Um, and if, like I said, if you have any questions, just let me know, but otherwise I hope you have a beautiful day and you can also feel free to connect with me on Instagram too. The luminary soul L L wait, the luminary S O L soul. So anyway, have a beautiful day. So much love to you. And I will be dancing with you, talking with you and illuminating with you. Bye-bye.